Good morning. This is vlog 461. Kathy's working out. I'm about to start working out, but we're going to be taking the Cadillac back to the ADM today. And tomorrow I'm going to be taking this camera back because it's not functioning properly. Lifeguard. We're getting ready to go take the Cadillac back to the museum. Any last words? To the dogs? I don't know. No. You guys have to stay here. I know. So sad. sad. What are you doing way up there? minor issues, one with the, uh, the fuel pumps, so I'm just keeping my fingers crossed that it can make it back to the museum and they'll take a look at it. Ladies and gentlemen, Tara Hitzig, right here at the ADM, at the Automobile Driving Museum. You guys got a lot of stuff going on. Always. We have a lot of stuff going on. In fact, we have a, um, our first ever lowrider car show, the best of big fish, this Saturday. This Saturday mm -hmm. is going to be uh, what we hope to be the ultimate lowrider event. Absolutely. Okay. Book signing for a color, adult coloring book. Really? Of lowrider cars. <laughs> I'll be here. I'll be here to check that out. If you have a lowrider or anything that resembles a lowrider close to, get your butt on over here because this, these events are always fun. Yes, get online and register now and uh, come to the museum. What can they look forward to? Oh, uh, good music, good food, great cars, book signing, um, and we have, they're going to have four different awards for the lowriders. Right here. You heard it right here. Awesome. All right. It's going to be awesome. Thank you. Dropped off the caddy. Does it make you sad? I didn't even get to ride in it. You rode in it once. Not this time. Really? I tried to ride in it today, and then you told me I had to drive my own car. <laughs> Kathy got into the Cadillac with me uh, to take the Cadillac back, not realizing that she we wouldn't have a car to come home in. Hey, this is Kathy's world. Welcome to it. <laughs> We're going to stop at the American Botanical Pharmacy to get some herb stuff. Or look. If you haven't heard of this place before, it's herbdoc.com. Really, really good stuff. If you're feeling not feeling healthy or if you want to just get healthier, this is a good start. As always, we have a great time at the American Botanical Pharmacy. Good stuff. <laughs> Super healthy stuff. Always fun to do. I'm making my tincture that um, the people at Dr. Schultz told me to take for my hair and my and my thyroid. This is like female something. Do 
two droppers of these. Oh man, it smells absolutely ooh, ooh. horrible. Ooh. One. What is this? This is echinacea. Two. Oh, well, I'll put too much water in it, otherwise I won't be able to get it down in one gulp. <laughs> uh, that looks like one in one gulp. Do I? That looks like wine. Do I need to say a prayer or something? <laughs> Smell this. <laughs> no, I don't believe. Oh my god! Oh, you spilled it on my hand. <laughs> it's your hand dissolving. <laughs> I think <coughs> it's okay. I'm okay. Not bad. Yeah. Yeah, 10 minutes from now. The smell is actually worse. We've been home for about maybe 15 minutes. And now we have to go back out again because Kathy's making enchiladas. My dad and Maddie are coming over for dinner tomorrow. And enchiladas are kind of a complex thing. Right? What? You're making enchiladas. I am. Vegan enchiladas. So we need to get a variety of vegan Inch a lot of things. Stuff. Yeah. All right, let's go. Enchiladas, <laughs> inch enchiladas. Gonna be delicious. Are they gonna be spicy? Nope. Can ours? Because your spicy? dad's coming. What about over? ours? Make ours spicy. Jalapeno sauce on top. Oh, yeah. Right on. Fine. What What do I need to do? Your mission. Yes. If you choose to accept it. Yes. Dog biscuits. Bacon, sour cream. Okay. And vegetable uh, broccoli. Boom, what's next? Thank you. Um, chips. And sparkling water, something that they would like to drink. And maybe guava juice. Bunch of nice guys. Much nicer here than just about anywhere else. Feels like a small town. That's because it is a small town, basically. Enchiladas. I probably will send you back for the things I forgot. What? Magic pumpkin. Magic pumpkin. You want to you want to know why it's a magic pumpkin? Because it does things like this. <laughs> yep. Amazing how that works. But you know, since I wore these yesterday, that doesn't really work for me. So let's try that again. <laughs> mm -hmm. These are you know what? These are really not that comfortable. Let's uh, let's try this one. Hmm. Not bad. Not bad. These came from my friend Michael Axon when we were driving those little. Never mind. He kind of looks normal when he wears these. I look a little. I think I'll stick with my normal ones. There we go. Happy as a clam. I'm going to take this pumpkin and I'm going to use this tool and then I'm going to do something to it. I'm not really sure yet, but then I'm going to give it away at Wheels and Waves, which happens to be this Sunday, people. Wheels and Waves is this Sunday, but it's not just Wheels and Waves going on this Sunday. Unbelievable amount of stuff is going on uh, this coming weekend. Let's get to it. On Saturday, I'm going back to the Automobile Driving Museum. They're gonna be having a low rider show. Cars, low, 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 and slow. And as soon as I'm done with that, I'm gonna be heading up into the valley because I'm giving a talk at the Hudson Club. You know, guys that drive Hudsons, if you've never heard of a Hudson, it's probably because you're not, uh, you're maybe less than 60 years old. But if you happen to be 60 and older, you know exactly what a Hudson is. I'm gonna be joining those guys. I'm gonna be hanging out with the Hudson Club. I'm gonna be giving a talk and we're gonna be talking about cool stuff. Then on Sunday, of course, is Wheels and Waves, number six, 
Classic. And we're going to be bringing in all kinds of really, really cool cars. But as soon as that is over, I'm out of there. I'm going to the Calabasas Pumpkin Festival. Plan on seeing some seriously cool cars there. And if there's enough time, if there's enough time, Kathy and I, we're going to be driving up to San Francisco. I don't know why I said San Francisco. It's not even close. It must be that's what's on my mind because there's something else happening. It's actually Oxnard. We're going to Oxnard. We're going to the Steampunk Festival. It's a ridiculous amount of car show stuff happening this weekend, but it all starts with the ADM, ADM Lowrider Show. Right here, ADM Lowrider Show. Now, if you are into lowriders, if you like lowriders, if you like uh, you know, riding in lowriders, or just taking pictures of them, or just hanging out you know, with somebody who actually owns them, it doesn't really matter, this is the event that you're going to want to go to at the ADM Automobile Driving Museum. ADM Automobile. It starts at 10 o'clock, it goes to 3 o'clock. It's a full day of lowrider coolness. It's going to have, they're going to have music, they're going to have food, they're going to have all kinds of awesome stuff going on. Join me in the morning, uh, stay for the rest of the day, but I got to head out. I'm going to the to the Hudson event, as I mentioned. We're going to be having a blast with those guys. All right, side note, I've been playing around with this this Canon camera. It's got some serious um, refractory problems going on. Uh, I did have someone tell me that's what Canons do. I can't believe that's what Canons do normally because it looks like crap. I can't believe that Canon would allow such a thing to happen. So tomorrow, Kathy and I are going to be going back to Best Buy, exchanging this camera for another one, probably identical. Unless they don't have it, to which I don't I don't know what's going to happen, but something's going to happen. We're going to get this problem worked out. And then I just got confirmation from the Art Center College of Design, uh, the Art Center Classic that's happening on the 23rd. I know this is a lot of information, people. Take notes. On the 23rd at the at Art Center College of Design, uh, they just accepted Ken's Porsche. I don't know if you know how hard it is to get into that show, but we're going to be there with Ken's Porsche and a couple of lowriders if all things go well. <laughs> this, and this holiday season is turning out to be spectacular as far as car shows go. It's just going to be nuts. All right, that's it for today's vlog. Thanks for watching. Join me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, all those other kind of places. There you go.